Let's turn to this now. People living in California Sierra Mountains could get two more feet of snow. This comes after they were already getting buried by this past weekend. Steve Patterson is there and he spoke with people getting ready for the next round of snow. An entire region digging out in the aftermath of around the clock winter weather thrashing. We woke up to a lot of snow yesterday and it never let up. This weekend, the storm of the season unleashed a life threatening assault on the mountain west, dumping five to ten feet of snow across the region and spawning blinding whiteout conditions on the roads. It kind of felt like we were like swimming through the snow almost. Just south of Lake Tahoe, several cars temporarily trapped when an avalanche crashed on the road. Thankfully, no one injured. The region's major thoroughfare, Interstate 80, shut down for days. A perilous mix of wind and snow, stranding drivers for hours. The road finally reopening today. The blizzard bringing snow totals to more than seven feet in several communities, with winds gusting up to 190 miles per hour in the highest peaks. It was full on. It was definitely some pretty intense periods of whiteout conditions. Today, relief. Blizzard warnings lifted for the first time since last week. This really turned out to be a storm. We were all kind of laughing and we were like, eh, it's snow, we've got this. And then snowmageddon. So <laughs> snowmageddon <laughs> did come. The storm moving out, allowing residents to catch their breath ahead of a few more inches of snow predicted right around the corner. Steve Patterson, NBC News, Truckee, California.